Cisco SecureX integration with Orbital. All right, so we've already integrated Endpoint AMP into um, SecureX, and now we're going to integrate Orbital. So this is the ability to do a forensic scan. So again, if you look at the available integrations, uh, Cisco's done a really good job of making sure that we've got a fairly decent um, third-party uh, capability right out of the gate, right? Um, you know, the product's only been available for about a week. So Orbital, add Orbital, save, you're done, right? Pretty easy stuff. Um, once you do that, then you can come in and obviously customize your dashboards um, and add any of the Orbital uh, elements that um, might be of interest. So in this case, we're going to create a new dashboard and then we'll look for the available tiles around Orbital. We'll call this uh, Security Search Engine. And you can see there's an organizational and a user uh, perspective of Orbital. So Orbital, it, from at least SecureX perspective in regards to the dashboards, is going to give you some insight about the number of queries, you know, results with errors, host queries, etc. But let's just jump into Orbital and, and have a little peek at, at what some of the th some of the things that you can do. So there's a, a, an awesome category of um, capabilities uh, available to you and it uses SQL. And in this case, this is around services. Uh, sorry, this is around startup. Um, so the ability to actually look at startup items that might be on an endpoint. So an adversary might have something in the run box on the uh, in the registry that allows them to you know um, start up a, a back end connection, right, uh, or a reverse tunnel back, and allow them to have persistence, right, uh, so they can continue to connect and. Um, access the system and so you might want to search for that so what I've done here is I've done a search and you can see there was nothing in the registry outside of what was on this particular machine but I'm going to go quickly and add a um, an element now you can search for this element specifically in this case I, I'm just searching for startup items when I hit live query, I just saved it. I did a live query now and you're what you're going to see here is is that we actually picked it up right um, and so you can copy this off you can investigate this further um, but it's pretty cool right um, that you can do that query very very quickly um, and you can schedule it right so you can do sanity checks against your organization looking for certain things or residual of the latest campaigns that might exist um, very very quickly when we look at assets I've just jumped back into orbital real quick again you know, Cisco Threat Response and SecureX, a lot of the capabilities are following. At the very bottom of that screen, you can see the SecureX ribbon is following. We've jumped into Threat Response. We looked at that endpoint. Obviously, this is very, very noisy. Um, but um, very quickly, we can, you know, do an orbital search. We can search for this ho host name in, um, in um, say, say, a third-party uh, intelligence source. Obviously, this is an internal host, so there wouldn't be much there, but pretty cool, right? Now you can use it to do some of your forensic scanning. 